Welcome everyone to a brand new series I'm doing. It's going to be called, well not really called, Speed Killing Bosses. I'm going to take a boss from a game and I'm going to just kill him as quick as possible. Alright, we're going to do Fire and Warriors because I really do like this game. And we're going to go after Frederick first because why the hell not? Okay, let's see how fast we can destroy him. That was really fast. Oh, but Cry, aren't you too fucking strong? Obviously, you were four times stronger than Frederick, and you had an armor-piercing effect. You were clearly going to kill him fast, dude. Like, Don't worry. I knew this was going to happen. All right, so before we fight Frederick again, here's what we're going to do. First things first, we're going to equip a lower-level weapon, and I'm going to keep some perks on because it's going to be all right. Right, and then we're going to still do it on the insane difficulty, but then what we're going to do before that is I'm going to go to the temple because in Fire Emblem Warriors specifically for this type of Muso, you can reset the character's level and all the way back to one, and we're going to do it for the sake of this video, even though it costs a million fucking dollars to do, but we're okay? going to do it, right? So that way, we're either under level or on the same level as Frederick, but since in the insane difficulty, Frederick is at 25, and I know we're not going to be a level one when we fight the boss, what we're going to do is whatever level I achieve, as long as I'm under the boss's level or at the same level, It'll count. It'll be fair game. So we ended up staying at level 13. I think this is good enough for the fight. All right, let's do it. Holy shit, 10 seconds is actually not too bad. I thought it'd be a lot worse. Okay, cool. So, yeah, this took a decent amount of time to do, but I honestly really did enjoy it. I would really hope if you guys like, comment, and subscribe really helped out most, maybe motivates me to continue. And if you guys do like this series, I'll definitely do more. I'll probably add other RPGs in the mix and probably a different Muso as well. And Borderlands because it's easier to get the details and to get all the informational stuff. So this is different from what I usually do, but I did enjoy this despite all the hard work. So yeah, I would really appreciate if you guys like this stuff because it's awesome. Tune in next week when I give you the other series that I'm going to test and see if you guys like it. All right, cool. Later.